Hey guys, Andrew Edwards here for Bleeding Edge TV, and in this episode, we're going to give you a better look at the Microsoft Surface Touch Cover. Touch Cover is a Microsoft's it's a cover, protective cover for the Surface tablet, but it also lets you type like a keyboard. It is a keyboard, but it's pressure sensitive, touch sensitive. There aren't any actual keys on it. We've got a, a few of them. We've actually got all five of the colors available of the touch cover, and we're going to give you a look at them right after this. All right, guys, so as we said, we're going to be looking at the Microsoft Surface Touch Cover uh, in this episode of Bleeding Edge TV. We have a few of them here. We actually have all of the touch covers that are available for the Surface tablet. You see there, um, we've got first the blue one touch cover there. As you can see, if we hold it up, that's how thin it is. There are no, the keys that you see there are not actual buttons. It's just a touch surface, touch sensitive surface. The other side there is just a soft touch material. No big deal. So that's the blue touch cover there. We've also got the pink model there. Let me get the surface back on. Pink model touch cover, same thing, exactly the same. Um, it connects there, here, uh, to the bottom of the surface. We'll show you that in just a bit. But there you go, pink. You do have the touchpad, uh, trackpad area there at the bottom. And again, the soft touch on the back. They've got this red slash orange. I'm not really sure, it's kind of in between the two red, orange, and actually does look kind of close to the pink, kinda, as you see there. And then they've got a white model, if you prefer white, nice and clean. And finally, the black model, and this one you can buy with the Surface for $100 extra, so the Surface is $499, if you want it with a black touch cover, it's $599, um, but these other ones, these colored ones here, these are an extra $20 each. Um, and we'll put them on here just to give you a look at what they look like with the surface. So as you can see, we're going to connect it here to the bottom there. It just clicks in. There you go. Now you're ready uh, to use the surface. Now, as you can see, I can go in there so I can use uh, the mouse if I want to. If I want to go to the desktop, go in there. So there's a black model. That's what the black model looks like on the surface. We'll pull that off and go over to uh, the white version. White model will click in. There we go. Surface with the white touch cover. And again, you got, you know, it does have the uh, kickstand there. If we close this down, you're actually supposed to be able to lift it by the touch cover. As you can see, that's how strong. I just went to the calendar. But that's how strong it is there. I'm lifting it by the touch cover. Put it back down. If I want to remove it, there you go. So it's a nice strong connection. Magnetic. Let's take, give you a look at the uh, orange one. Let me pull this kickstand back out. Orange touch cover here. There we go. Clicked in. So there's a surface with the orange red. Not sure what Microsoft's referring to it as right now. Go to the pink. There you go. Got a pink touch cover. As you can see, two fingers to get across, one finger to just move the mouse uh, cursor around. And finally, the blue. Here we go with the blue touch cover right there. So as you can see, really easy to put it on, take it off. Um, you do have to get used to doing some touch typing. And if I pull up something like, I don't know, what can I type in? I guess I can type in Word. Pull up Microsoft Word here. Let me zoom in, give you a look at uh, how precise this is, or the lack thereof. Zoom in. Okay, so I'm just going to use the touch cover here. And I'm going to start typing. And already, mistake. I'm trying to say thanks for watching. 
this episode of Capital Ble Bleeding Edge Capital and Work That Time TV. So it's not um, if you want to type quickly, you hit backspace, you just tap it and hold it down. That's nice. Um, if you want to type quickly, it may take some getting used to if you want to go with the touch cover. Get back there. But, um, you know, for casual typing, if you're not trying to type out a, you know, bang out a super important uh, document, you can easily use the touch cover no problem. It also lets you go back to the, you know, the home screen. You can use it to do all sorts of stuff. You want to get into the settings or the share rather. You can share. There's a share button there. You've got uh, your devices. You can get into settings directly using the touch cover. Page up, page down, delete, escape. So, um, and again, you have the uh, multi-touch trackpad. So it is nice. Um, and I, I would even say for using the Surface, it is kind of, it's almost essential. Um, if you want to use the Surface to its, to its greatest capability, the touch cover is kind of essential. I'm um, going to get it. It does. It folds up. You can put the kickstand down. And then you've got a nice a cover for your Surface. And then when you want to get back to work, you just pull out the kickstand, pull your cover down. Surface will turn right back on, and you're ready to do more work. Go right into the, right into the home screen there. So that is your look at the touch cover for the Microsoft Surface again. Multiple colors. It's available in aside from black. You've got the white. You've got the uh, the red orange. You've got pink there as well. Um, so that's it. Tune in next time for more tech news through theazagearlive.com. I'm Andrew Edwards. <laughs>